Have you heard about this cool new way to dig tunnels? It's called plasma tunneling, and it's pretty wild. Even Elon Musk, the guy behind Hyperloop, didn't know about it. The people who came up with this say it's way faster and cheaper than old methods. Here's how it works. They use super hot spinning torches that melt and blow up rock. They can dig about a kilometer in just one day. The best part? It only needs electricity to run, and they can make it bigger or smaller depending on the tunnel size. It even works in tough spots where other diggers struggle. They're still testing it out, but it might be ready to use later this year. This could really change how we build things underground, like subways or water pipes. Pretty neat, huh? Fun fact. The torches are about 27,000 degrees Celsius. That's hotter than the surface of the sun. What if your car was like a tiny robot taxi? That's the idea behind the B, a new city car from Continental. This small electric car drives itself and fits one or two people. You just use your phone to call it when you need a ride. The B looks really different from normal cars. It's see-through. The doors and roof are clear and can show you information too. It can go 220 miles before needing a charge, but only drives at 38 miles per hour max. That's okay for city trips though. Cars like this could make getting around town much easier. No more hunting for parking spots. Fun fact, self-driving cars might help reduce traffic jams and air pollution in cities. Romania might not be the first place you think of for cars, but they're actually pretty good at making them. Back in 2018, they put together about 500,000 cars. Recently, a car company there came up with something really different, an electric buggy. Now, they're not planning to sell it, but it's super cool. They made it to test out some new ideas. Some of these ideas are really clever, like the headlight comes off so you can use it as a flashlight. And check this out, the seat covers are actually sleeping bags. The tires never go flat, and you can wash the inside with a hose. They also made this neat clip system to attach all sorts of things to the buggy. Plus, your phone can work as the car's computer. Good to know. While we can't buy this buggy, these ideas might show up in other cars someday. It's like seeing a bit of the future. Ever wanted shoes that change color like a chameleon? Some clever folks came up with just that. They're called shiftwear sneakers. Here's the cool part. You use your phone to draw a design and bam, it shows up on your shoes. It's like getting new sneakers every day without buying more. These shoes are tough cookies too. You can toss them in the washing machine. They use special e-ink stuff to make the designs work. But wait, there's more. The soles have super strong Kevlar and get this, they charge up while you walk. No plugs needed. They even packed in Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. You can make the pattern change when you jump or dance around. Lots of people love this idea and chipped in over $760,000 to make it happen. Good to know. While Shiftware sounds awesome, we can't buy them yet. Their website is down now. Sometimes cool ideas need time to become real products we can actually use. Hyundai, the car company from South Korea, has some cool ideas about future cities. They showed these off at a big tech event in 2022. They think future cities will have lots of robots and a big online world where people can do all sorts of things. They also want to help people who have trouble moving around. Hyundai made these neat pods that can help people get out and about in the city. These pods can join up to make a kind of bus. They also think we'll have flying cars that can take off and land straight up and down. Hyundai's big idea is to make it really easy for everyone to move around in cities. They want to change how we think about travel. Good to know. While these ideas are exciting, it might be a long time before we see them in real life. Big changes like this take many years to happen. Check out this cool new motorcycle called the WMC 250 EV. A British company made it, and they think it could be the fastest electric bike ever. The bike looks really different from others. It has a big hole in the front that lets air pass through. This helps it go faster by cutting down on air pushing against it. Because of this special design, it can slice through the air much better than other bikes. The makers say it's more than twice as good at this as the next best bike. They haven't tested how fast it can go yet, but they want to beat the current record of 228 miles per hour. 
They hope it can even go faster than 250 miles per hour. Good to know. While this bike is super fast, regular electric motorcycles are getting better too. They're becoming more popular because they're quiet and don't pollute. Did you hear about the pyramid news from Egypt? There's some interesting stuff going on. So the famous old pyramid of Cheops is closing for a bit. They need to fix it up, which makes sense because it's super old, like 4,500 years. But here's the cool part. Egypt wants to build a new huge pyramid. This one will be way bigger, about four times taller than the old ones. They're planning to put this new pyramid in a big new city. Get this, they want to launch space tourists from nearby. Inside the pyramid, they're thinking of making a whole hidden city with homes, restaurants, and fun stuff. They even want to put a space research center in there. They haven't picked the exact spot yet, but they say they'll build it like the ancient Egyptians did, just with modern tools. Imagine a car that you control with your body, not your hands or feet. Sounds like science fiction, right? Well, Toyota came up with just that. They call it the FV2. Toyota showed off this crazy idea back in 2014. It's nothing like the cars we drive today. The wildest part, there's no steering wheel or pedals. To drive the FV2, you just move your body. Lean forward to go, back to slow down, and side to side to turn. It's like riding a giant smart skateboard. This car is pretty clever too. It can sense how you're feeling and even change its color to match your mood. It also remembers your usual routes and can help guide you. The FV2 is a one-seater, so it's just for you. Good to know. While the FV2 looks amazing, it's just a concept for now. Car companies often create wild designs like this to inspire new ideas for future vehicles. Electric cars are becoming more popular. In 2021, sales doubled to 4.6 million. China is buying a lot of them. So many companies are getting into the e-car business. Volkswagen is one of these companies. They made a super fast electric car called the ID.R with 680 horsepower. But now they're working on something different, a car that's more about being practical and easy to use. This new concept car is meant for sharing. It has a smart computer system that drives it. The system can plan trips, find parking spots, and know who's riding in the car. You can even talk to it if you want. The car fits four people and has a cool windshield that shows information like a screen. Volkswagen thinks this kind of car could be the future. It's not about being fast or powerful, but about making getting around easier for everyone. Good to know. The first electric car was actually invented way back in the 1830s, long before gas-powered cars. A Dutch designer who's worked with big companies like Netflix and Microsoft has come up with a cool space rover. It's called the Guru Terra Incognita Space Rover and can carry six people. The rover has six electric motors to make sure it keeps going. It's built in parts, which makes it easier to fix if something breaks. The special design of the hull and some automatic safety systems give the crew a good chance of staying safe if there's trouble. The rover also has a smart system called ASA that helps it move around and avoid dangerous situations. This is really important when exploring new planets where the terrain might be tricky, it's exciting to think about how vehicles like this could help us explore space in the future.